Razabani for IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. I'm delighted to have with me a victorious Jonathan Kumuteo. Jonathan, firstly, how are we doing? I'm fine, thank you. And yourself? I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Great to be out. Great to finally kind of get that second fight under your belt. I know you waited a few months, but did it feel like a debut again? It did. You know, the crowd was there. I heard people cheering me on. My mum, my dad, my three sisters that were there. You know, my close friends, family, everybody, you know. I'm happy. This is like the real debut, you know. It was tough, but we got through it. And, you know, I trusted my coach. You know, he's put me through hell for this training camp. So now I'm glad that he put me through it because tonight now we smile and we move on to the next. You know, I believe it was a much better performance than the first. It was tough and, you know, I'm happy. Four rounds, you've got obviously the rounds under the belt. Sometimes fighters come out and they blast their opponents in, in one round. They don't really learn a lot from, from that one round that they've been. I'll, I'll start with you first before I move on to the coach. Um, good to get four, firstly four rounds under your belt, but were they quite tough four rounds? Yeah, they were tough, man. You know what? Kevin's had over 230 fights. You know, that's way more than my amateur fights and hopefully however many pro fights I have. I'm not trying to stay around for that long, but... You know, it was a great experience, you know, shout out to him. I learned a lot from that fight, you know, and that will help me a lot moving forward. You know, I'm also glad to have eight rounds in this year. The last 18 months, <sighs> stale for everybody. But for me, it was more than 18 months, it was three years in total. So to get eight rounds in my first year as a professional, I'm just glad, man. How can I not be glad? You know, shout out to BT Sport, Frank Warren, Ross, the rest of the team, Rod, Sam, Bo, Jordan, they give me hard sparring every week, you know. And now, it's moments like this, I leave the ring really appreciating them. You know, I shout out to my friends, family, and everybody that came through. Let's bring in Coach Ross. Coach, the last kind of 18 months have been difficult for yeah. all these kind of upcoming fighters and prospects, as this show is called. Mm -hmm. um, was it hard on yourself to keep people like Jonathan kind of engage and discipline and in the gym and focus, not knowing when that next fight's going to be? It's always hard to keep them in the gym, staying positive when times like this, but we try our best. Um, Jay only actually come to me this year anyway, so we didn't have long for the first ago. one, yeah. And um, kind of straight into the second one, which is good. We want to keep him active, we want to get him out hopefully one more time again this year. But positive, um, he done dug deep in this fight, Kevin's experienced. So we knew it was going to be tough and he was going to come out like a ball every round. But I thought Jay dug in deep, took some shots, and Kevin, he took some blinding shots. I was still in his feet after the first round. He wobbled him, he wobbled him twice. And I thought if Jay would have pressed on, he could have, could have got him out of there, which, which would have been a statement. But all good. Got through it. Onwards and upwards. On to the next. What have, you, what have you seen in the gym from Jonathan that we can look forward to? How good can he be? He is tough. He is tough and, he, and he, he trains hard. So when you've got a tough lad who trains hard and he stays dedicated, he stays around the gym, in the gyms, you know, he doesn't go out. So it's good. He, he lives a professional life. And that's, that's what we want to see as a coach. Jonathan, obviously, I know the last couple of months has boxing's returned. Fans have come back as well. But is it good people like Frank Warren, BD are putting shows on on a Friday night for prospects, for those with who are debuts, one fights or two fights, to get out and, and finally start their careers? 100%. You know, it's a great opportunity for us, mm. especially after what we've all been through. You know, shout out to Frank. He's been signing a lot of young, up-and-coming talent. And, you know, we're on a great platform, you know, with BT Sports. You know, shout out to Queensbury, shout out to Ross Pierce. He pushes me a lot, sponsors. man. Shout out to my sponsors, you know, Fitz Dez. Shout out to my brothers, my sisters, my mum, my dad. You know, everybody, shout out to IFL. But, you know, also big, big, big thank you to Fitz Dez. You know, they've been supporting me for a long time, way before I turned pro. And, you know, with their support, I'm able to do a lot more. And it's not just, you know, for fights. They're there for me a hell of a lot. Where do you believe you'll be campaigning? What weight category do you think you'll be the strongest in? Super World Tour, 154. Absolute stacked division, as we know, in the UK. How far away are you from kind of the, the Ted Cheesemans, kind of that level, the Fitzgeralds, etc.? We've we, we still, we still got a way to get to there. It's all, it's all learning. It's only mm -hmm. your second professional fight. It's, it's all learning in this game, you know. He needs to box the southpaw, everything. So, no, good. Kevin was a good test, brilliant test, come through. So onwards and upwards. Hopefully get out before Christmas. 
please. Hopefully. That yeah, will hopefully. be a great birthday present. You know, my birthday is on 5th of November. <laughs> and it'll be a great Christmas present. So, you know, shout out to Frank. Can I get one more fight, please? <laughs> <laughs> so, Frank, congratulations once again. And we look forward to following this journey. Uh, do you want to plug your Instagram, your Twitter? Where can the fans follow you? JK Boxing, RC Pierce. Shout out to the team today. We glue up, we showed up, and now we show up. Thanks to RJ's gym as well. You know, we train down there every day. So thanks to Rod for letting us use the gym all the time. So well done. Jonathan Russ for IFL TV, thank you very much. Thank you guys. Thanks, mate.